I've been struggling with my substance use for so long that I didn't know if I was ever gonna make it out of it. The environment that I'm in, that we in right now, this is a family environment. I, I love this, this environment. I'm just proud to be a part of the DRC. The DRC really changed my life for the better, to be honest. I feel like I'm in control now. I don't have to be so self-destructive, and I don't have to, I don't have to give up. It was the best decision I could have ever made. It changed my life. It gave me the opportunity to be re reunited with my family. The first part of this is honesty. We gotta realize that we've been dishonest with ourselves and the people around us. When I first got here, uh, I really didn't, didn't think I was gonna be able to do this. I really thought I, like, I didn't have it in me. I ain't gonna make it. I can't do this. I'm just getting out of jail and I'm tired. And this is jail all over again. But I was wrong. One of the greatest things happened when I came to the DRC. As a week or two went on, I began to put in place what the DRC, what I needed to put in my life to move forward. So I worked it like that. After I talked to a couple people in here, and they, my counselor, they just tell me to keep my head up, I can do it. It was like I ain't never had nobody who really told me I could do it until they started telling me this. So I started believing in myself a little bit more. I was motivated and you know uh, determined to uh, complete the program as well as not disappoint myself or my family. The easiest thing to do is come. And it's really like they're gonna do the rest. Like they, they, they give you the material that you need to study. They give you the tools you need to make sure that you, that you hold on to your sobriety. Cause our sobriety is very important to them. And I just seen it in all of our counselors, all the, the CC1, well, the CC2s and the CC3s. I just seen it in all of them. They care about our sobriety. I was able to succeed. You know, their patience and continue and, and the fact that they just didn't want to give up on me, it was, I had a lot of chances, you know, and they could have sent me, they could have sent me back to jail any number of times. I won't see another good day if I just let it all go, if I let it all fall apart. Um, um, so although, although graduation is a good time, it's, it's, a, it's a time to celebrate, it's a time to, you know, relieve some pressure, but that doesn't mean that I have to, I have to forget all my lessons. I have to just forget everything I've been through. If I take what I've learned here at the DRC and apply it into my recovery, I'll be all right. I'll be just fine. It changed my life. I, I really don't know where I would be without them. I, I honestly, like this is the best thing that has ever happened to me. No matter what obstacles stand before you, no matter how tired you be, there's no reason that you can't succeed and do better. And I'm a living testimony and living witness to that. They ain't doing it for the money. They doing it because they genuinely want to see people be helped. That's what I love about them, because they want to see us be helped. As long as we open our heart to let them in, they gonna help us. They gonna make sure they take us across their finish line. It's been difficult at times for sure, but <laughs> uh, you know, I, I don't know that I'd be where I am health-wise were it not for the program. So, if you need help and you're not afraid to ask for help, I promise you, they will give you the help that you need and that you want. It's something that you got to put inside of yourself. You know what I mean? Focus. If you want to get it done, it's gonna be on you at the end. They've been kind of hard on me at times too, but <laughs> for the most part, you know, it's been all out of love and want to see me do better, you know. So I'm, I'm forever thankful. It made me feel so much better, that's why I already know. As long as I got these folks on my side and I got myself and I'm being true to myself, and can't nothing stop me. That's how I feel. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to miss them after this year, <laughs> to be honest. Uh, um, I'm really... I'm really, I'm really proud of myself now, and I don't think I would be here without them. I'm happy, and I'm proud of myself, and I'm dedicated. The DRC has given me hope and strength to go on with my life.
and they gave me courage and I really appreciate that. DIC has given me motivation, hope, uh, desire, and control over my life. The DRC has given me accountability, stability. It's given me courage, hope. The, the DRC has given me the ability to pull my life back together. The chance and redemption. They done made me responsible for my own actions. Faith in myself, gave me a new life. The DRC has helped me to realize that there are greater days ahead. All I have to do is keep looking up. I'm, I'm stronger now. I'm more confident now. They done made me grow into the man that you see today. Gave me a new me. The DRC has given me hope. I've become a better person over this time, over this year. And just thank you, DRC. It gave me everything that I need to start my new life. The DRC has given me a future, honestly. Uh, that's as simply as I can put it.